Chick. Good boy. Hey everybody, if you're trying to get pregnant and you're interested in, whoa, if you're interested in online or at home fertility testing, so I have some news for you. There's a recent study that looked at blood testing for fertility reserve in women, so that's your anti-malarian hormone, inhibin levels, follicle stimulating hormone, FSH, stuff like that. And it turns out they're just not predictive. If you're interested in trying to test your ovarian reserve, one thing that has been recommended for years is to do an FSH or an AMH or an inhibin level or all of the above to see what your ovarian reserve looks like and that that would hopefully predict your chances of getting pregnant. And although they are helpful potentially with people who are undergoing IVF to predict success rates, it turns out just not predictive in the spontaneous pregnancy, spontaneous conception category. So, you know, if you're thinking about spending 140 bucks on an at-home AMH test or coming into the office and getting an AMH or an FSH level, I wouldn't recommend it. So this, this study was based on uh, 750 women who were studied prospectively for up to a year. These were folks who had just started trying to get pregnant, so not with any history of infertility. Didn't predict pregnancy rates at all. So you could have good numbers and not get pregnant. You could have bad numbers and get pregnant. It didn't make a difference in time to conception based on results. So basically I wouldn't recommend spending your money on that test. Uh, I wouldn't recommend actually getting a test in your doctor's office either because it turns out that these labs just aren't predictive. While it is true that age is associated with reduced fertility, the testing is just not there yet to really try to figure out who is in good shape and who might have a hard time. So, you know, just keep that in mind. I'd save your money on the test. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Have a great day. If you have questions, put them in the comments below. I guess that's it.